Hi guys, I'm back with my new video. Uh, well, this video is oriented to for all those uh, people who are just now having some issues after they have upgraded to Windows 7, uh, sorry, Windows 11, or they are in the Windows 10 latest version. So this problem arises whenever we are in between of any work, especially if it's a gaming laptop and if it's 144 hertz, we are having this issues that we have some flickering lines coming in between of the screen. Uh, so here's a quick fix which I have found out right now and it's uh, working uh, Till now it's working very great for me. I've been using it for uh, About the laptop for about one uh, one to two hours for now and still the problem hasn't arrived but uh, Yesterday I was facing too many problems while doing my work. I was unable to do any of my editing work and uh, for so so here's a quick thing that you need to do is that quickly you have to come up to uh, system okay then you need to just go towards uh, your display and down there you will get advanced display refresh rate settings and this is windows 11 in my case so and in windows 10 you have to just go to the same thing and just you need to change from 144 hertz to 60 hertz and if your desired settings is on 60 hertz then we have to change it to 144 hertz and yeah that's it and once you're done on it uh, uh, you will see the, yeah, the flickering is gone ultimately i think it's not uh, it's uh, for the time being i think it's the driver issues or something with the driver that is uh, making this faulty issues in it and uh, it's just for my uh, series of laptop and if you guys are getting the same issues you can try this and quickly after like after changing to 60 then you can again change back to 144 hertz after uh, 10 to 20 minutes and uh, the flickering will be gone i think it has some software issues and after that if you have this uh, uh, like i bought my thing from asus so i have a asus central over here just quickly go to one click diagnostics like i have done it and it's saying that no problem found till now so yeah so uh, this is the catch for me I think this tutorial will help you guys to evade these issues for the time being. I think Asus or some of the gaming laptops that we are having same issues in it with the 144 hertz. Uh, they should uh, come up with some fix or some driver fix for this uh, on the latest Windows patch or update. So that's it for now. Thank you. Have a nice day.